Hey everyone, it's Mike from Hilo Solutions. Hope you had a great week. Uh, had a long week ourselves, tiring. Last week was uh, really busy with uh, the two rigs and uh, that we had to finish up and deliver and trainings uh, and such. And, and then this week we started on some, uh, some more surface cleaners and uh, we got, uh, we're working on these uh, 17 gallon a minute machines and uh, they're tough, man. Uh, they take a while to get all the everything kind of fitted properly. The skids were too small uh, compared to the 15 gallon a minute ones. And uh, just, you know, you get challenges after challenges. But uh, I wanted to get on here and uh, kind of talk to you guys from a contractor's point of view. Um, I talked to a lot of contractors and uh, one of the things, you know, that kind of um, shocks me is the fact that a lot of companies uh, kind of don't get uh, what efficiency is all about and what it really will do for their company. Um, uh, you know, we obviously sell these beast rigs and our beast, and uh, it's not for everybody, you know, but if you're doing large surfaces and a lot of commercial work and everything, uh, HOAs and such, uh, you really need to check this thing out. Um, these rigs are uh, really superior. Um, 15, two 15 gallon a minute machines, uh, large, uh, you know, uh, hoses and hose reels and, um, and everything. So we have the capacity to be able to do a lot of work, uh, off of these things. Um, just to kind of give you an example, last week, um, the guys went ahead and, um, we did a training. It was about 30,000 square foot. I think he charged anywhere from right around $3,000, I want to say. And, um, when we got to the job, you know, obviously we were doing training, so it takes a little bit more time. Uh, to do and um, so we're doing this uh, particular job and they uh, told me that last time they did it it took them two days with two guys and really about a day and a half he said of actual uh, job time however you know with labor and drive time and everything else you're you know you're basically two days with the labor cost so um, we got finished with this uh, particular project uh, in less than four hours. It was about three and a half, 345 or so uh, uh, time frame, and uh, it was completed. We didn't soft wash it. We didn't uh, pre-treat or post-treat. Uh, we didn't use really uh, any degreaser. Um, it just cleaned really, really fast, and uh, they were blown away, um, you know, and so we were sitting at lunch, and I talked to them, and I told them, I said, hey, I said, just think about it. If you line up the right work and you schedule properly, and they do a lot of commercial work, so I said, you could have done, in the same two-day period, you could do conceivably about $12,000 worth of work instead of $3,000. Basically, $3,000 in the morning, $3,000 in the afternoon, next morning, $3,000, next afternoon, $3,000. Uh, it's not rocket science, but a lot of guys don't get it. And uh, they don't really see past that or they don't see past the cost factor of what it costs to buy a rig like this um, and such. I mean, I've got guys right now that have done buckies, um, a couple buckies. And before he did the first buckies, he did it with uh, without the beast and he did it in uh, 12 days with eight guys. The next time he bought the beast and he did uh, same size buckies. And he did it in five days with three guys. And I asked him, I said, Adrian, I said, how much money did you save just in labor costs? Not even asking what his profit was on this or anything. And he says, my labor costs, I saved about eight to 10 grand just off the top of my head without even figuring it out. I mean, and then on top of that, he had seven more days of work that he could have been doing. And, and he did, obviously. And so... When you see that, those are the factors that a lot of guys don't calculate. Yes, you save, you spend money on the equipment, but that efficiency is gonna save you a ton of money on labor. And that's just one week worth of labor that he had for this one particular job. So I just wanna encourage you guys, um, when you're looking at equipment, you know, um, equipment should be an investment. It should never be a cost. If you have the mindset that it costs you money, then you're not really getting it. Um, if you have the understanding that it's um, uh, that it's an investment, uh, totally different because that's going to make you money now. You know, it's the difference between. I mean, I, I know guys that will go out and buy a ninety thousand dollar pickup truck instead of buying a twenty thousand dollar used pickup truck, and they say, "Oh, I need it." No, you don't. 
that's a want. That pickup truck is going to be the, not get make you any more money than that twenty thousand dollar pickup truck is. But a twenty thousand dollar rig versus a sixty seventy thousand dollar rig is going to make you a ton more money. And that's where the difference is, where a lot of guys don't get, and they don't look past uh, the actual cost factor. Um, we're here for you. Uh, we try to help contractors out. Uh, we really want to help uh, contractors. I've been doing this since 1997 in the purse cleaning business myself. Um, uh, I've done uh, real well uh, for myself. We sold my company last year, and that gave us the ability to start High Low Solutions. And uh, I own a paver sealing company, so we do, you know, we're in the field, you know, and we uh, basically solve problems uh, to make it faster and better and more efficient. And we're constantly coming up with new stuff, even for our own equipment. And so if we could help you in any way, please feel free to reach out to us. Uh, we'd love to be able to talk to you and help you out. Um, uh, we also offer financing. Um, and so the financing company that we deal with is not that click lease. We're going to spend a lot more money. Uh, this particular one is actually a loan at CIT Equipment Company. And they give uh, really good rates uh, for equipment. And uh, so we try to help guys out to get, uh, you know, approved and everything else. And uh, that company works with us uh, because they know our equipment. If there's anything we could do to help, please feel free to give me a call, 561-779-3291. Uh, Mike from Hilo Solutions. Hope you have a great weekend, guys, and uh, looking forward to uh, talking to you soon. Bye.